Hey guys, this is a quick video where I'd like to talk about the concept of a subnetwork. Now, we're all familiar with the internet, where all of these computers and web servers and so on are connected together so that we can contact each other over the network. However, one thing you need to know is that the internet is subdivided into subnetworks. One good example of a subnetwork that you might encounter is the one in your home. The subnetwork is basically a group of computers that are isolated together and generally can talk with each other and interact without any interference such as a firewall or going through some sort of internet service provider. So to look at the details of a subnetwork, I'm going to use the ipconfig command here in my home. So if I run ipconfig, it shows me a little information about my subnetwork. Now it shows me my IP address that's been assigned, both the IP version 6 and the IP version 4, but it also shows me two other pieces of information. One is a subnet mask, which is something we use to identify what other computers are on the same subnetwork. It also shows us the default gateway. This is the computer or device that we send that we send messages to when we want to contact a computer that's outside of our subnetwork. So let's talk about our home subnetwork for a moment. Within that subnetwork, we might have our PC or laptop, uh, our mobile devices, our television, our IoT devices, and so on. These devices probably get their IP address from a common device, such as your router uh, within your house and they can all talk to each other. Your subnetwork is then isolated by your router from the rest of the network, uh, the rest of the internet in general. And anytime your device wants to send a message to a computer outside your subnetwork, it would send that message to the default gateway, and the default gateway would route it to the appropriate computer. The way in which your computer would determine if that other computer it's trying to contact is on this network or on a different subnetwork is using the subnet mask, which I'll talk about more in a later video. So this is just a brief introduction to the idea that the internet, being a larger network, is subdivided into smaller subnetworks, and each computer on that subnetwork has its own IP address and has a way for it to determine if another computer is on the same subnetwork and if not, where it should send their messages to.